We're at a property down in Ammonford today and it's got an ancient board. It's got an RCD module which takes up four positions. There's a different array of makes. We've got two different types of contact in here. Um, one modern type of GE, General Electric, and two original types of General Electric. I've got an MK in there as well. Um, it's a 30 milliamp RCD technical board, it's like a 16th edition or earlier. Um, it trips on the mechanical side of it, but it doesn't trip when you introduce the fault. So it needs to be replaced. Um, the IP rate in the board has been compromised in more than one location, and it's got 16 mil tails. So that's going to have to be uh, sorted. Um, the gas main is there, it is bonded in a tender. It's a really poor earth here, and the earth electrode is just there with um, two 10 mil cables going to for some reason. Um, but yeah, so I'll run the gas pipe in there. Once that's safe. Anyway, we've got uh, Liam is upstairs. And he is replacing, or fitting rather, a light fitting, because it was missing. So he's, he's winding up the pendant there now. Um, we've got loads of other shoddy things here. We've got unprotected cables in here in the cupboard, which less in trunking, so why is not in trunking? Cables just slung on the floor as well. We've got a damaged patches box. This socket here, oh I forgot to drink my coffee. This socket here is on the old oven circuit, so it's fed with a six mil. But this fridge, freezer, Oven and hob are all fed off a multi point connection down there and a plug in the back of this cupboard. I don't know if you can see it, you probably can't see it. There is a single 30 socket outlet feeding that lot. That needs to be sorted. Also, we've got a shed here which has washing towel dryer or more than one of each actually there's an old cpn metal card board um battery's gone so the light doesn't work that's least of his worries there's no rcd protection it's got two 30 amp circuits in an arc as well as a six and 20 and you can see there's a lot of damp in here the screws has gone rusty on the sockets and they've been painted over there's no mechanical protection on any of the cables I don't mind so much up there, but the drops definitely need to be conduit. You can see the moisture all of the cables look, and the light fit in. This light fit in here, I would imagine it would, it would probably trip the RCD if it worked. It's got wet inside lock as well. Oh, oh that's not good, is there? Very unsatisfactory. And this socket as well, I had to close this window. This socket, this socket was, socket was soaking, socket was soaking. So it could do a better ventilation in here. But I think if we put an IP65 light in here, we would be better off. I gotta polish my camera skills if I'm gonna continue doing this YouTube channel.